what we know is that Russia stationed about 40,000 military boots on the ground, 10,000 of which are Russian regular army military boots. Uh, the only person who denies Russian presence in Ukraine is President Putin. So if they have free internet, they can provide him with the footage from internet when they deliver tanks, artillery, howitzers, and even SA-11 and SA-22. Russian play is to blame Ukraine for not implementing the deal and saying, look, that's Ukraine who failed. That's the reason why we drop off this deal. No chances to no avail. We will be the last one who is to say that Minsk is dead. No. There are fingerprints of President Putin on the Minsk deal. So he is obliged to implement the deal. And uh, uh, Madam Merkel, Chancellor Merkel and President Hollande, they contributed a lot of their political capital into this deal. They did a lot to make this deal happen. And we are to stay united and to act in concert in, in, to make Russia to implement and fulfill the deal. What is the aim of Putin? Definitely not to make Ukraine happy. His aim is to resume something that resembles Soviet Union. His aim is to take over Ukraine. His aim is to dismantle Ukraine as a nation, as a, as a country. What's happening in Ukraine is not just related to us. This is the global challenge. It relates to everyone sitting in this room. Russia is the threat to global stability and security. This is not the way how P5 member can act. They have to change their policy, or we have to change their policy, and to, to, to get one united, strong policy towards Russia. The only language Putin understands is strength. So let's be strong.